This question here it says, if the triangle in the previous question, in this question here, this triangle here, is revolved about the side 5 centimeters. In the previous question, we had this triangle where hypotenuse was 13, base was 5, and height was 12. I have flipped this right angle triangle. I have flipped this right angle triangle and taken height as the base, base as the height, and hypotenuse remains same. Then it says, same triangle is revolved about the side 5 centimeters. Now I have to keep this side still and revolve this triangle 360 degrees. I will get this type of cone where radius would be 12, hypotenuse would be 13 which is slant height now and height would be 5. Then it says find the volume of the solid so obtained. So this is the solid which is a cone. Let's find out the volume. 1 over 3 pi r square h. 1 over 3 into 22 over 7 r. Radius would be 12. 12. Height would be 5. Let's see what the answer comes. I have 22 into 4 into 12 into 5 over 7, which is 5280 over 7, which gives me 754.29 cn cube. So that's the volume of this cone obtained from this triangle rotated 360 degrees on this side which is 5 centimeters high. Then it says find also the ratio of the volumes of two solids obtained in both the questions. In the previous question I have obtained this volume which is 314.29. In this question or from this cone I have obtained this volume so ratio would be 314.29 over 754.29. I can take 314.29 as 100 pi approximately, and I can take 754.29 as 240 pi approximately. From this 22 over 7, if I keep this as pi, then 4 into 12 into 5 gives me 240. So in place of 554.29 if I write 240 pi this is approximately same. Same I can do here. 22 over 7 I take as pi. So 5 into 5 into 4 gives me 100. So in place of 314.29 cm cube I can write 100 pi cm cube. So this would be 314.29 would be 100 pi. 74.29 would be 245. So this becomes pi to pi cancelled. 12. So this would be 5 over 12. So ratio of this cone and this cone is 5 is to 12. That's the answer here. Done.